Last summer, Curtis Painter had a ticket for the first day of the draft, if not the first round. Now most people don't even have him in the draft's top 10 quarterbacks. We'll show you why we think he could be a second day steal on Draft Guys TV. Curtis Painter had an outstanding junior year, but he disappointed in his senior season as he dealt with the loss of his favorite targets, Dustin Keller and Dorian Bryant, a shoulder injury, and his own inconsistency. Curtis Painter might be the most pro-ready quarterback in the 2009 draft. NFL quarterbacks have to throw to where the receiver is going to be, not where they are. When we look at that again, Notice where the receiver is when Painter decides to throw. Painter won't break radar guns, but he has the arm for the 15-yard out. And he throws a tight enough spiral that tipped passes still find their target. Curtis Painter smoothly executes play-action fakes. And what's particularly impressive is how quickly he comes out of the fake sees the field, and places the ball between four defenders. Watch how quickly he goes through one, two, three reads, and automatically checks down. Curtis Painter is accurate and under a variety of conditions. Here, Painter throws a strike into tight coverage. When a DB cheats inside, Painter puts the ball outside. When his receiver has a 5-inch height advantage, he lets him go up and get it. And when a defender is in his face, Painter adjusts his delivery and still hits his receiver in the numbers. You're watching Draft Guys TV here with Curtis Painter. Curtis, how's it going? Very well, very well. First day of practice. Uh, always a little, little rocky putting things in, but uh, I think we had a pretty good day so far. Now you come from Purdue. Kyle Orton, Drew Brees, have they given you some tips? Um, I, I've talked to them a little bit about the process. Uh, you know, just this draft process, uh, what to expect uh, in this next year. It's, it's going to be a very long year for us. Um, and just, you know, kind of how to deal with that. Uh, more than anything. You played a lot out of the shotgun. How comfortable are you with your three, five, and seven step drop? It, it's definitely a, a big focus that uh, I've been working on right now in the off season, uh, you know, getting ready for the preparation. Um, so I'm getting comfortable. I uh, feel pretty good about it, and uh, you know, hopefully that'll continue to grow and I'll keep getting better. Curtis Painter doesn't have the gaudy upside of the top three junior quarterbacks, but he'll be a great late pick for a team that needs a pro ready backup. And if he ends up starting, he might be tough to displace. For more information on Draft Guys TV, go to draftguys.com.